following takes place between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m. on the day of the bombing of Pearl Harbor. Channel 101 News, and here are our reporters. Good evening, I'm William Wrigley. And I'm Cherry Cheerios. Yesterday, on December 7th, Pearl Harbor was attacked by Japanese aircraft. And here is Michael Dintin reporting in at the White House with FDR State of the Union address. Thank you, William and Cherry. And here is our President, Franklin D. Roosevelt, and his State of the Union address. My fellow Americans, yesterday, on December 7th, 1941, a day which will live in infamy, the U.S. was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. The U.S. was at peace with that nation and at solicitation of Japan, was still in conversation with its government and its emperor, looking towards the maintenance of peace in the Pacific. While this reply stated that seemed useless to continue the existing diplomatic negotiations, it contained no threat or hint of war or armed attack. Yesterday, the Japanese government also launched an attack against Malaya. Last night, Japanese forces attacked Hong Kong. Last night, Japanese forces attacked Guam. Also, last night, Japanese forces attacked the Philippine Islands. And this morning, the Japanese attacked Midway Island. As Commander-in-Chief of the Army and Navy, I have directed that all measures be taken for our defense, but always will our whole nation be member of the onslaught against us. Thank you. Months later. There's Channel 101 News, and here are our reporters. Good morning, I'm Terry Cheerios. And I'm William Wrigley. Today is February 19th. The Executive Order 9066 was passed by President Franklin Delano Roosevelt. And here is Michael Dentine with General John L. DeWitt. Thank you, William and Cherry. The Executive Order of 9066 was indeed passed today to relocate ethnic Japanese people into internment camps. Here is General John L. DeWitt. A Jap is a Jap. I don't want any of them here in the United States of America. There is no way to determine their loyalty. It makes no difference whether he's an American citizen, he is still a Japanese. American citizenship does not necessarily determine loyalty. But, but, we must, as American citizens, worry about the Japanese all the time until he is wiped off the map. Hi, my name is Ben Dover. I am here today with two American officers, and they're here to talk about the internment camps. Over here, we have Lieutenant One. Do you think the Executive Order 9066 is necessary? Of course the Executive Order 9066 is necessary. So the good of the country, the safety of our troops. And over here, we have Sergeant Black. How are the Japanese treated in these internment camps? 
They are treated perfectly fine. We do absolutely nothing to them, but provide them with good food, good shelter, and work to keep them fit. Just like, you know, most Americans are. Well, that's great to hear. Thank you, guys. Or are they really? We are officers! Officers, of course. Internment camp officers. Yeah, this is an internment camp. Yeah. Take the living the life. Yeah. Good shelter. Good food. They deserve every single bit of this. Yeah, Not after what happened at Pearl Harbor. I lost my brother there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, help me. Help us, please. This is so bad. I'm hungry. I'm starving. Me too. Give us food. Yo, you guys want food? food? Yeah. Oh. No. Frosted flakes right there. Eat some. Tastes good. Frosted. No. Flakes. No. I can't last I this the rest of my life. No. <laughs> no. You can stop it now. The following takes place between 11 a.m. and 12 p.m. on the day in which Executive Order 9066 was in effect. Ah, oh, what a nice day. Yep, it's a pretty good nice day. Oh yeah, guys, did you hear? The government starts to arrest Japanese people. I think it's because of um, Executive Order 9066. Are you sure? Do you think that's what happened to us? No. Of course I mean... We're only half Japanese. It'll never happen to us. Yeah. What is it? Hello? Freeze! Freeze! LAZ! Whoa! Put your hands up in the air! Right, Due to the executive order 9066, you will all be relocated into internment camps. Oh. Yeah, one minute to get all your stuff. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Right. Get, get out! Get up now! Get up now! Get up now. Get up now. Get up. Please don't shoot! I don't care! Yeah, please don't. Get up! Go! Get out of the house! Go! Get out of the house! Go. Go. Get out of the house. Where are we going? What is this? We have guns! Go! This, the internment camp. This is all they have to eat. Guys, I don't think we can do this anymore. I can't keep going on like this. I'm starving. Stop complaining. So, this is gonna no. be your whole until the war is over. This is going to be your food for the next three weeks. Three weeks? Three weeks. That's going to be a bathroom for three weeks too. That's small. That's not small. Oh. What? Fits you Japanese. Perfect size for you guys. I yeah. Heard they, I heard these internment camps are good. They yeah. are good. You get to exercise right there. See how you're going to be packing crops. You can't eat. This is the leftovers. You ate these. What are you don't talking complain. about? Don't complain. If you don't want to eat it, then just don't eat it, right? You what, eat it. what are we going to do? Just We did eat it. it. <laughs> we had three hours ago. What are we going to do? Just sweep? Ow. Yeah. Sweet! Keep fit like an American! I don't want to do this anymore. It's tiring. Oh my god. No, this is just not working. I hate you in the white t shirt. It's a dirty spot over there. What spot? Clean it. What about dog? Okay. Ma'am, stand over here. Firewood. What? Fix up that pile. Now, hurry up. You with your hose. I need some water. What are those plants over there? Leave Watch out for my puppy. Leave me alone. What are we gonna get out of this place? By 1945, two nukes were dropped in Japan. The Japanese captives gained their freedom and the Japanese family returned home. The following takes place between 5 a.m. and 5.30 a.m. on the day of the dropping of the American atomic bomb. Let's
15 kilos on glass Put an end to the war pretty fast Two cities with more than bitch Finally home guys, finally. Finally. Let's go back inside. Yeah, open it. Nice door, nice door. Anyone home? Uh -oh. Who are I'm, you guys? I'm sorry, you guys don't live here no more. Yeah we do. No you don't. This sorry, can't you be. don't live here no more. Sorry, close the door. Now what are we going to do? Yeah.